Hi guys, my name's Mitz and I just wanted to show you how to remove the featured slider which is going past here on the Mag Max responsive WordPress theme. Um, I bought it off Theme Forest and it's fantastic, I love it. Um, now I'm going to show you, I've got it on another website as well. Now on this one I removed the featured slider because it was taking too long to load. Um, it was quite big and um, now I've removed it. This is the front page and it, if I press on it, it loads up pretty quick. Okay, now this one's not too bad but um, it could be faster. So I'll just press on that and see how it's loading okay so I'm sure people have got a worse internet connection than I have so I'm going to remove that right now okay um, I'll just see I've got the actual code open here now I'm going to show you how I do it now first you go into your dashboard of your website okay so you have to sign in you know to the admin area um, now you've got to be careful if you're not experienced okay so now if you have um, the max mag theme installed already under the appearance menu you would have this um, here and also this um, but in this situation we're actually going to go into the code and edit something ourselves because um, even though it says there's options there, there wasn't an option where I could just tick a box and remove the slider. So I'm going to do it myself. So I pressed on editor and then over on the side here it comes up with all the templates and I've gone to main index template which is index.php because the slider only shows up on the front page. Okay. So I didn't have to go to any of the other ones like a page or a post. It was just this one here, index. Okay, so uh, what I did is all I did was look for featured container and take all that and go down. Now you've got to be very careful when you're touching code, okay? So keep going until it comes to the end of featured container there okay so you've got featured container don't touch anything else right now what I'm going to do is cut the code out so I'm going to right click on it and say cut now you'll see that the cursor is still flashing where that was now take note of it that um, I took the code from in between these two here okay just in case you need to paste it back so just for safety's sake I'm gonna grab a notepad that I've already mucked around on and I'm just gonna paste the code down there just so I can grab it back if I need it okay so there it is there that's just in case I need to put it back in right so we're right we've taken it out now we're going to press update file and we're going back to the home page now there's the featured slider going around now we're just going to press on the home page and it's loaded bang right now I have to muck around with this a little bit to get it looking like this like take the title out of there and stuff now the other thing is that there's so many choices in this theme so this blog has got the latest posts showing here whereas this blog has got the latest posts on the sidebar and on here I'm actually manipulating what posts go on there so I'll just go and add another few sections in here to fill up this big gap that I've got down here now and um, that was pretty good it was easy um, you know I just need my sites to load up quickly and um, this this um, themes fantastic 
but the featured slider was just kind of dragging it down for now. Alright, thanks for watching.